Good morning, Wolf Pack. I'm meteorologist Kyle Hanson, and after a gorgeous weekend and a gorgeous Monday, that's not said too much, we are going to see the clouds return. If you look at this, we had a cold front slip on through early this morning, and that's what's giving us the clouds, and that's also going to keep our temperatures low today in the 50s. However, we will not see any of this rain back off to the uh, south and west in the lower Mississippi River Valley. However, this is a sign that we are going to be seeing some moisture sometime soon. Now today we are going to be in the 50s. However, you know, it's going to be cloudy, but we aren't going to see any rain. It might be that type of day where it looks like it's going to rain, but it's not going to rain at all. Uh, 50 degrees at 8 a.m., 55 at noon, and 56 by 4 o'clock, and that will be our high temperature. Today we're going to top out at 56 degrees, and look at this. We have the northeast winds at 10 miles per hour. That's going to usher in some cooler air, and that's why we're not going to see the 70s again today. However, we're not ready to say goodbye to the 70s just yet. Tonight, we aren't going to get uh, too low uh, this evening, around 52 for our low temperature, and that's because we are going to switch our winds to the southeast, which is going to bring some warmer air into our system. And then we also have the clouds and the showers building later on, but they won't be any downpours, nothing like we're going to see tomorrow. If you look at this, this is the map for Wednesday, and we have a huge batch of rain off to our west, and that's all associated with this cold front and that is going to push on through throughout the day tomorrow. However, before that front moves through, we are going to be uh, pushing the thermometer, at least for February. We'll be up into the lower 70s yet again. We did it on Monday, and we're going to do it again tomorrow on Wednesday. But look at this. Winds out of the south at 15 to 20 miles per hour. We could see an isolated gust of maybe 40 or 50 in some of the thunderstorms that we could see. However, we're not going to see too much in the way of severe weather, but we're definitely going to get a lot of rain. Uh, but this weekend, we are going to improve the forecast. Let me step out of the way for you. We'll be in the 50s Saturday and Sunday and lows in the 30s. So overall, pretty seasonable, but dry weekend for February. And then the week ahead, we see that the showers are still going to linger on Thursday with highs in the mid 50s. And then by Friday, we are going to see the skies clear out and we're going to be in for a nice glorious weekend next weekend. This is meteorologist Kyle Hansen in the NCSU Weather Center.